Look, the entire town's very excited about this. You are a first time movie theater owner. How did this come about for you? So it's actually a group of family of four. They're all local. And my husband and his business partners own O2X Human Performance. They decided to buy this bottom floor. Um, kind of came to the wives and said, we're looking to buy this floor. And we're like, yeah, we're not doing it unless we open up that theater. We don't want to be those people. So we named it the Real Harbor Theater. All the bathrooms kind of have a fish, fishing pole feel kind of keeping it nautical and coastal, very simple setup. All your candy, popcorn, um, we're in the process of ho hopefully getting an alcohol license. We've learned that in the film industry, the concession sales is where you make your money. We have to give about 50 to 60% back to the film distributors for ticket sales. So everything that comes out here is where we're able to make our money. Before you took over, there were two theaters here. Now there's one. Why? So to get the O2X Human Performance Headquarters, we had to break it down to one, which I th feel pretty confident that that's fine for this town. The challenging part is that in the film world, you can't split a screen. So if you do a first run show like Elemental, which is our first show, you have to show it for a two week minimum. Cannot share the screen with anyone else. So initially when we came up with this idea, we thought, oh, we'll do a kid show in the morning, an adult show in the afternoon, and that's just not how it's gonna go. <laughs> how do you choose which movie you're gonna select? Um, right now I'm going off of a company has all the box office sales called Comscore, but a lot of it's my heart right now. It's just what I feel is right, and I really, really wanted to 100% kid family friendly movie to start. The movie The Flash is coming out on the same day, which is definitely going to do better in this, you know, box office. But I wanted my five-year-old and my 15-year-old to come. I want everyone in the world to be able to show up and not have it be exclusive in any way. We are looking to break even. So this isn't a livelihood job. This is really a community give back. It's for the people here. So we're hoping that if people show up, we'll keep our doors open. Why do you think a movie theater is important for Citrus? Um, for me, I feel like when we moved here 10 years ago, looked at all the South Shore towns, it was just this really special bonus, you know, to be able to send your, your kids down to a movie and have family date nights and just kind of be here and not have to get in the car. We live in a bubble. We like our bubble. Ha, ha, ha.